I could do that all day, just like that. Hey, welcome back to the Cobra Pit. And I'm pretty excited because I finally, finally, finally was able to get my hands on the pilot. Now this is Andar's third iteration of the pilot and they said they figured some things out, worked out some kinks and this is the best version. I haven't had the other two versions. I wanted to get the other two versions. Wasn't able to get them. So now, you know, I'm pretty excited to get this one and uh, we're gonna see what it's all about. Now it is back in stock and just my opinion, letting you know, they sell out pretty quickly. So it comes in a nice box right here and right away this is not your granddad's wallet all right just letting you know nice little card here nice little message and as soon as you open it you get a whiff you can smell it you can smell and are because the thing they're famous for is having premium full grain leather and i do not exaggerate at all when it comes to this if you ever seen or felt or smelled full grain leather, you know it's legit. And full grain leather is the highest quality leather that you can get. I believe this is the stone gray color. Now, let's see what else is in the box first. Okay, nice little baggie and oh, some leather cream. Okay, some leather cream. I like it. Just looking at it straight forward. Here's what you see. Small, small logo. This is where you hold your cash money millionaires. This is what makes the pilot so special. So it has two car slots right here in the front. This is probably where you'll put your most accessible cards. It says two. I'm gonna slide two in right there. I have two in right there. No problem. Okay, I see that. It's, you can easily grab these out. Now it is tight, which means it won't fall out. I will probably put my ID right there. A little snug, but um, I'll probably just keep my ID right there, right? I say that's my ID. Next, it can hold up to six cards in the center slot. Now this center slot is an anodized aluminum case, so it's RFID protected. I got six cards, right? Six cards, six cards. Let's put them in. All right, I got six cards in there. And I wonder if I could fit another one. But it says six, I'm gonna go with six. So the beautiful thing about this is, watch this. Pull a little lever. Bang. And they are staggered. Now this one looks a little hard to see. Let's try it again. And there it is. So whichever one you want to grab, you have easy access to it, right? Perfect. Uh, now this is it's not stiff, but it does take some effort to do. That means it won't come out easily in your pocket, but look at that. Bang. Ooh, I did it kind of hard. And there they are. Now I wonder if I can shoot them out. Let's see, let's see. Bang, nope. Doesn't even fall. So here it is, if I did a normal, I can fan it out and get any card that I want. That's pretty dope to me. Now it is a thin, thin profile. Now I wonder if I only had a couple cards in there. What will happen with a couple cards? So I'm gonna put two cards in there. And you can see there's two cards in there. And, huh, it's not coming out. It's not coming out. That's pretty solid construction. Now, there it is, there's my two cards, right? That is pretty dope to me. I love the way this looks and feels. You see another Andar logo right here on the back. Okay, but what is this all about? Well, let me keep my six cards in there first of all. This is where you hold your cash money. And it says up to 15 bills, but I don't have it like that. I have, how many bills do I have? I have, I have three bills. And what I like about this, a lot of wallets, you have to try fold them, right? But this one, you fold it right in half and it should slide right in. Oh yeah, see that's the perfect shape right there. 
Now it is wiggly, a little wiggly. You know, I told you I don't have it like that. So my three bills is kind of, kind of loosey. Uh, so let's say I did fold it again. See if it makes it a little thicker, make it better. Actually, yeah, I did like that. So if I had to fold it again, it holds the money there a little more tightly. So that's pretty cool. And that way you don't see what the bills actually are anyway, you know. But I like it. I like it. Oh, man, this is the wallet. Now, I'm wondering if I could do it one-handed, right? So I'm pulling it out of my pocket and I need those cards. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I got it down now. Here it is. Bang. Oh, oh, can I do it with this hand? Uh, bam! <laughs> no, nah, I'm not, I'm not left-handed though. But, and I keep it in my back pocket. So that's the thing. My thing is, I'm a back pocket wallet kind of guy. So the thing is, how will this feel when I sit down? I'm putting on my butt now. And it's slim and it feels solid. So I like it. It feels solid. So six cards here, two cards here. I would go with one card here. It's kind of tight. But if I had to, yeah, see, it's kind of tight. But the beautiful thing about that full grain leather is it is a little stretchy. It has a little bit of wiggle room. Not much, though. Not much. And it holds up to 15 bills. So if you're interested in the Pilot Wallet version three, go ahead and of course there's the discount code below, but right now they're having a special, special promotion that you can get 25% off of your order. So look at the link in the description and they're doing a very special Prime Day, pre-Prime Day sale, but get it before it sells out. You know, look at the different colors they have. They're gonna have the Camel tan, they're gonna have it in black, of course. Saddle brown, which is very similar to the Turner. Another beautiful wallet by Andar. And olive gray, but I'm loving this one. But any color you can get, I would rock it. Oh, that's so dope. Oh, I could do that all day, just like that. And I'm not worried about my cart. What if I, so even with them fanned out, can't even shake, I'm loose, get it, get it. So yeah, man, this is a pretty dope wallet. I'm excited to have it. Definitely will be a conversation starter. And uh, let me know in the comments how you feel about it. Hey, thanks for watching and don't forget, Cobra told ya. All right, y'all.